it's Leslie. Welcome back to my cross stitch channel. In today's video, I'm gonna sh be showing you and talking a little bit about my plans, my cross stitching plans for 2023. Uh, I just want to say that these are plans, and plans are subject to change. They can change at any moment. But um, what I want to do this year, this cross stitching year, is uh, I want to buy more kits from eBay. Kits that are, that are mm, not produced anymore, like the older ones by Dimensions and Busilla. I'm interested in those, um, so I'll be buying those. And I'm gonna be starting a lot new, a lot more new um, uh, kits and having more um, works in progress. Maybe I won't be able to cross stitch all of them, but I at least want to start cross-stitching a lot more and a lot more new cross-stitch kits and some of the kits that I am thinking of starting maybe not all at the same day but like uh, I'm thinking more like seasonally like if I for winter I would like in winter time like to start this kit by Nova Sloboda I think it's from Ukraine this kit is I'm not sure um, it has 40 colors, and I like this because, um, I, when I think of winter, it's usually a lot of cross-stitching with white, and I don't like to cross-stitch with white. This, uh, is more of a kit that has, um, more colors, and that's what I like. Nothing to see here, unfortunately. Um... Uh, next two kits are by Dimensions. This I bought on eBay. This is a kit by Dimensions that is not, um, it's not produced anymore. Uh, I I think it's gonna be a very easy kit because there's a lot of um, half cross stitch, not a whole cross stitch, but a lot of cross half a cross stitch. So it's gonna be cross stitch. Um, it's not gonna be so difficult to cross stitch. And the beautiful colors. Yes, and one thing is that these kits that I've chose to start in 2023, they are going to be very colorful because I like color. Uh, I just, I mean, I like the kit that I did with the bo bo body threads with the black, but still it's kind of hard to cross stitch with just one color. It's It gets boring. So what I want to do is to start kits with a lot of color. And this is a great kit for um, the springtime, to start in the spring, Dimensions kit, gold collection, 15 by 10 inches, Cherry Blossom Creek, and look at the beautiful colors. Then I have two kits by Riolis, and I have decided which one I want to cross stitch. These are like a pair. But I'm not going to start both of them. I just want to start one of them. And uh, I would like you to vote. Which one do you think I should start? This one? I think it's Dahlia's or, li or, the, li or the Lilies. And these are cross-stitched with uh, acrylic or wool floss. And this is 10... Yeah, the, both of them are 10th count Ada fabric. So... What would you like me to start? Dahlias or lilies? Let me know. Next kit that I want to start is this kit by um, Riolis. This is... Um, I, I really don't care about di dinosaurs. I'm not interested in them. But I really like this kit because it's so colorful. The colors are so psychedelic almost. Uh, this is 15 by 15. And this is not wool, this is um, cotton uh, ink uh, floss. This is a kit by Alisa. And I like the sunflowers, but I don't like the, um, the background. So if I'm going to start this kit, I'm probably going to change the background. Because I don't like it. Very colorful chart, easy to follow. For the fall or autumn, 
It will probably be nice to start something with a lot of orange in it. And this is a great example of that. This is by Design Works. 12 by 14 inches. What beautiful uh, fall colors. And in the summertime, I would like to start this kit uh, by Jen Lin. And this is a sampler. Uh, summer montage. I have all of her kits um, samplers. This is the the um, the summer one, and I have other ones, and I have a video about it uh, on my channel about all of her samplers and montage kits. So check it out. I'm probably gonna change the um, fabric. I just use plain Ada fabric white. I guess this is so nice. I like the color. I, I want to keep it. So I'll change it. Then uh, there's a new... Actually, there are two new um, cross-stitch kits that I want to start. This is by Lucas. I've never done a kit by Lucas before. Uh, and uh, it's not the animal... I, I chose this kit not because I like animals. I, I do like animals, but I don't like the cross-stitch animals. I like flowers and there were a lot of beautiful lilies in different colors that I would like to cross stitch and this is cross stitch with um, I think this is uh, anchor floss beautiful bright colors and the last kit that I might um, I might uh, cross stitch is um, this one. This is by Letty Stitch. Beautiful roses. This one has 50 colors. Also beautiful colors. But maybe not so bright, but still very nice. And um, there are three charts that I chose that I liked. That I might cross stitch, and all the three of them are from Joan Elliott, and I'll show you them. The first one is uh, Puppet Theater. This I'll probably have to buy about thirty different colors of DMC floss. Um, and then I have the Rainbow Fairy. That's about fifty, fifty-five different colors. I will probably have to buy separately because this is chart, not a kit. And also, I will need um, beads. And this one, the Tree of Life. And I'm probably going to be cross stitching the two other kits that I started in two thousand twenty-two. The one by Magic Needle and the one from a, an old Polish um, um, magazine. But let me know in the comment section below what kit or chart you would like me to cross stitch this year. Uh, that's about it for today. And I hope you have a great new year. And uh, give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Comment and subscribe. I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.